Hi, my name is John Murphy. I'm here to introduce you to the new 2.0 PPS system from 3M. The new system has some distinct advantages over the old. The new gun is a very high strength metal and you, you can drop it and it's much more durable. It is the lightest spray gun in the world uh, and that's the one thing everybody notices when they start using this, how light it is. The other new advantage of this gun is the attachment system of the nozzles. That was a weak point of the old system and also the attachment system from the uh, cup and collar. A couple things to notice about this, it's very easy to attach the nozzles. You basically pull the trigger back, you slide this on, and you just do a two-thirds of a turn left and it locks it on. Compared to the old system which had the ears, sometimes those ears would, would snap off or uh, wouldn't completely lock in. So it's a much better locking system. Another big advantage is the attachment system, which before was a much smaller one. They've increased the actual air flow or area for the fluid to go down. And that just connects on here and twists on. So it's, a, it's more robust. Tips, uh, these tips, come in a very wide range. They start at a 2.0, go to a 1.8, a 1.6, a 1.3, a 1.4, and a 1.2. The actual great advantage of this system, once you take the tip off, is to just wipe the needle valve off. So no fluid actually goes through the gun. Another great advantage of this system is um, the old system was a clear cup with a liner that you put in for graduations. It is now included in the cup and it has a sight glass in here, a clear area to actually see the fluid. And also one of these cups is included with every case of lids and liners. So it really enhances the use. But basically what you do, like the old system, you drop your uh, liner in there, you put your lid on here, which has the mesh screen on here to filter your, your product. You just snap that on, turn it on, place it on the, on the unit. And then once you uh, apply pressure here, it's HVLP. I usually run it about 20 pounds. It, it sometimes depends on how thick the product is, but 20 or lower. And then once you have the product in there, if you open the air all the way and pull the trigger, you will actually bleed out any excess air in the bag and create a closed system. So you then can spray inverted in all different orientations, which is a big advantage, especially in tight areas. The other thing about this, there's virtually no cleanup other than wiping the tips. Tips are designed to be thrown out. You can clean them and reuse them, but after a certain amount of cleaning times, the overspray will walk out on you. Uh, you'll lose your tight pattern. The other thing I wanted to also go over was the different sizes. This is the standard size. They also have the larger size. They've got a little bit smaller, and then they've got this really small guy for quick touch-ups. The video that I'm gonna link to this, a bow yard is spraying primer, all grip 545 primer, and then top coating with all grip. The two things that came away from that demonstration was he used a lot less paint than he normally did because less paint is over atomized into the air so more ends up on the surface and it was quicker it took him a lot less time to actually paint the boat than he did before you say well what are people spraying through this it's, it's pretty much the whole gamut from gel coat right up to stains primers enamels varnishes any water-based products that's it for now please watch the video and um, if you have any questions, please call C.W. Hayden. My name is John Murphy, and I'll be happy to uh, answer any questions. And I think that's about it for now. Thank you.